Roya, I visited Bosque Farms where Justin Hansen lived, and neighbors who know him say he was a nice and very polite man. Neighbors in this Bosque Farm community say they were shocked to hear Justin Hansen is now accused in such a violent crime that nearly killed a teenager. Hansen and his family have lived in this community for years. Neighbors told us he was friendly, a good dad, and hardworking. They said they would see him working on the Hansen's family farm. Because the community is so close, they did not want to be interviewed about Hansen's arrest. Bosque Farms police officers helped Albuquerque officers arrest Hansen Thursday night at a grocery store. Okay, you're wanted for, for some stuff, okay? I didn't do anything wrong, though. Okay. Personally, as a woman, I think that women will feel safer with him off the street. Bosque Farms police says Hansen lives in this community, but they've never had any run-ins with him until his arrest this week. But now he's a suspect in a brutal attack that happened eight years ago when a teen was beaten with a shovel. Years after it happened, Brittany Marcel was able to remember more about the attack and DNA led officers to Hansen. Marcel's sisters were there for Hansen's first court date. She was so excited and she's like, they caught him, they caught him, Kathleen. And that like, just the excitement. I haven't heard that excitement in a long time. Officers say they first spotted him at a gym, but made the arrest at a grocery store. They said he was surprised, but cooperative when they took him into custody. For, I'm Katie Mush, KYT Action 7 News. Okay.